Alrighty, so welcome to the Overwatch World Cup 2023 online qualifiers. Now that Denmark, Portugal, Iceland, and Finland qualified through the wildcard challenge, the stage is set for teams to earn their spot in the first Overwatch World Cup land tournament in four years. Qualifiers start on June 22nd to July 2nd. We are allowed to co-stream this, and I think we will be watching a lot of these matches chat. We don't get to watch too many matches right now with co-stream, so to be able to watch the World Cup qualifiers, why not? I think it'll be a ton of fun. So we'll be on stream, we'll be doing that, as well as drops. I'm working with that. So you can find the full match schedule here, which we'll figure out later on. Where to watch, you can watch um, live and earn Overwatch World Cup drops for Overwatch 2 on the following platforms. Play Overwatch, Overwatch Contenders, and on a bunch of other channels too, we will have drops enabled for this event. So it says you can also tune into some of your favorite streamers and content creators who will host online qualifier watch parties. You're like, okay, so what are the drops? First of all, Here's the watch parties to take part in the celebration and host a watch party. Fans, streamers, and content creators are all invited to join in by using the following titles and hashtags when co-streaming. But right here, drops are enabled for all online qualifier watch parties. So now, everybody's wondering what the drops are. So believe it or not, there's a lot of drops. How it's going to work. Kick off the 2023 Overwatch World Cup qualifiers with in-game rewards from June 18th to July 2nd. Watch and earn World Cup celebratory cosmetics when watching on Twitch. We will have these drops enabled on our Twitch. So, for two hours, you get a World Cup 2023 spray. For another two hours, you get a 2023 player icon, World Cup one. If you watch for four more hours, you get the Winston World Cup home and away skin. If you watch for another four hours, you get the Wrecking Ball World Cup home and away skins. If you watch for another four hours, you get the Zenyatta World Cup home and away skins. And if you watch for another four hours, you get a Ramatra World Cup home and away skins. There's going to be about a 20 hours worth of drops here, which obviously we've never seen that with, with drops. So I'm not going to complain, um, but we will have drops enabled here. I'll show you the previews of those skins right after this. So make sure to connect your, connect your account on Twitch and all that. On top of that, they are going to be adding a crowdfunded prize pool. For the first time in Overwatch history, we will be crown, crowdfunding the World Cup prize pool with an exciting slate of skins and other in-game cosmetics over the coming months. 25% of all Overwatch World Cup cosmetics and bundles will contribute to the Overwatch World Cup prize pool. There will be no contribution cap, so prizing will continue to grow until crowdfunding ends on the last day of the Overwatch World Cup finals. In celebration of our return, we are allocating a portion of the prize pool to all teams competing in the tournament. Percentages will be determined based on the tournament placement, with 73% of the total prize pool going to the top 16 teams, qualifying for LAN, and the remaining 27% equally distributed among the teams that competed in the online online qualifiers and wildcard challenge. Here is all the percentages here. So first gets 25%, then 10%, 8%, 6%, 3%, 1.5%, 1 and then 1%. Um, for pretty much all the World Cup teams will get something out of that. So... Our first bundles, the conference bundles, will be on sale June 20th, 26th. So if you look right here, you can get the uh, World Cup home and away skins for Reaper and Ash, Widow and Rhine, Diva and Kiriko, and then 25% uh, of uh, all of these bundles will go towards the prize pool. As we get closer to the finals, we'll unveil our legendary and supporter bundles. We are particularly excited about the legendary skin, which is worthy of th the deep blue gods that inspired it. You can check out a sneak peek of the skin concept art below so this is going to be the sojourn uh world cup ocean goddess is one of the skins as a thank you to all the supporters of the overwatch world cup crowd funding campaign we'll also be rolling out fun milestone rewards like celebratory sprays and player icons that will be distributed to all overwatch 2 players milestone rewards with um will be revealed along the announcement of the overwatch world cup legendary and supporter bu bundles in the fall so i mean listen We've seen crowdfunding with a bunch of games before. I think it's going to be cool that they're doing that for the World Cup. So pretty much 25% of this will go to the prize pool. And it's it's an uncapped prize pool. This could be a huge prize pool. Uh, and and honestly, we get to co-stream these matches. Because as you know, we can't like really watch all all matches right now. So we can co-stream these matches. And we have a bunch of drops starting the 18th to the 2nd, like 20 hours worth. So uh, for drops, we're going to be streaming a lot, chat. So make sure to get your drops. All right. Now, people are wondering, what are the drops? Well, let me go show you very quickly here. Here we go. So, for, for the Winston drops, you'll be able to get the home skin of the Overwatch World Cup right here and the away skin. If I'm correct, this is, these are the skins you'll be able to get. Then, there is the Wrecking Ball one. This is the home skin for Wrecking Ball, and this is the away skin. So, these are the skins you'd be able to get for watching the streams. You can also get the Zenyatta away skin or the Zenyatta home skin. And then there's the Ramatra skin, which would be the away skin and the home skin. 
So these are the four skins you'll be able to get throughout the, um, for watching. So, <clears throat> we finally have, uh, skins back with drops, which is really, really cool. And that, that is what that is right there. Uh, on top of that, I wonder if we can see the sprays right now. I don't know if we're gonna be, yes, and here's the World Cup spray that you get for watching for two hours. And what was the other one? It was a spray and something else, right? Oh, player icon. Okay. It would be this one right here. And you'd be able to get this player icon, Overwatch World Cup 2023. So those are all the drops. There's about 20 hours worth of drops. We will be streaming a lot during that. Um, so make sure if you want to get drops, up by the stream. And uh, yeah, it, it's cool to see they're doing a lot of drops. And there's going to be more drops even uh, next month too.